Terraformer export. In today's video, we're going to look at different ways of doing the Tibialis raise. Really great exercise to avoid shin splints and protect your knees when you're decelerating. Now, a year ago, I showed you how to combine a kettlebell and a stick, but I found better ways since. So let's check them out. A year ago, I showed you the hack with the kettlebell and the stick. Now, disadvantage with this is that first you can't train barefoot, you have to wear a shoe otherwise it's uncomfortable, and you also need the right angle or bench setup. I discovered by chance by training at home. Uh, I couldn't get, do that setup properly, but I had a Bulgarian bag. And, you know, training barefoot, no shoes, is just the best way to go. So it gave me ideas, okay? Now, not everybody's got a Bulgarian bag, so I'm gonna show you how I just set it up with the barbell. If you only got one Bulgarian bag, you simply use a bungee cord and some plates, and then you can increase the weight. Now, you know, the setup, anywhere you can do this, a chair or whatever, and you're basically good to go. So you just have, you know, holding on one finger for the straps just to avoid the bag rolling off. Now, the great thing is that the weight is actually on the end of the foot where the toes are, and as you bring the bag up, it's gonna create some frictions against your shin. So the dimension, the bulk of it, is a really good setup. If you're at the gym, or if you've got access to a barbell, a yoga mat, it's gonna give you that padding so the bar doesn't roll over the foot back and forth, you know, again, especially if you're training barefoot. And then, just to demonstrate, you can use anything that you've got around the house, you know, or around the gym. Piece of rope, here I've got a strap, yoga belt strap. Um, here I'm just gonna put just a single loop like this, okay? Straighten the legs as much as you can in front of you. Again, we're just holding on to the ropes to, uh, to guide the barbell so it doesn't fully roll off. Make sure you feel that centered. That's it, and boom, there you go. You can lean back, get more uh, straight legs, you know? And that's basically your setup for the tibialis raise. And because you know, using a barbell or the uh, Bulgarian bag with the extra plates on top, you can really uh, load progressively and incrementally. So I hope you enjoyed those new hacks for the tibialis raise. And leave us a comment. We'll catch you in the next video. Mm -hmm.